Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, Aries? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, whenever you come across my channel. I hope everyone is staying safe. How's all of my subscribers doing? Hello, I love you guys. Thank you so much for your positive energy. Thank you so much for your beautiful comments, your likes, and your shares. It means a lot to me. This channel is all about positivity. I am positive thoughts and energy. <laughs> to new viewers, cross watches, come on in, take what resonates, leave the rest for someone else. Apply the gender roles and reverse the roles how they fit in your life, okay? Because I don't know your life. You have to reverse things, re reverse the roles in your life, all right? So I had him, I have in my spirit today. Like I was telling my other signs today, um, I, I just seen rainbows, rainbow, the, you know, the rainbow is like, it's magical, all colors. So what's your favorite color? Aries, what's your favorite color? Put in the box. I'm having uh, my signs to put their favorite color in the box because I know, um, the color is energy. Okay. No matter if your color is brown or beige or whatever, and you look up those, look up your color on Google your color and see what it is, and focus on that positivity in that color for you today, okay? Um, because it's energy, okay? Um, you can look at you can look at this color green, and you can perceive it as something negative, or you can perceive it as something positive, okay? So it's, it all holds energy. So th that's, you know, something like that's also therapeutic for you as well. Uh, when I say I rainbow, rainbow is happiness. Rainbow is, you know, finally getting past, so, you know, like seeing the seeing the light at the end of the rainbow. It's magical. It's beautiful color, you know. The best is yet to come. The, the best is here. Uh, it's time, you know. Um, happiness. It, it can just mean all. You can look it up. It, it can, rainbow is a beautiful thing. So it just came in my spirit. Um, today is going to be about color. Okay. So if you want to put your favorite color in a comment, that's beautiful. Or you can just go and Google it and it'll tell you so much about that color that is your favorite. Okay. And just focus on that. All right, Aries. So let's see what your affirmation is for this morning. Spirit, what is Aries' affirmation? Oh, two cards came out. So spirit, that's good. All right. <laughs> Didn't I tell you? Rainbow? I just feel in my spirit. Rainbow today. Look what it says, Aries. It says good things are going to happen. Okay. Can y'all see that? Because it's... um. Got a little bit um, the reflection. Good things are going to happen today. <laughs> I said today, but it says good things are going to happen. That that rainbow is the light at the end of the tunnel. That rainbow is magical. That rainbow. Have you? I don't know about some of y'all. I mean, I'm old school, okay? But I was when I was a little girl. I see a rainbow, and to this day, I still do it. I don't know about y'all, but to this day, I still do it. I see a rainbow in the street, in the sidewalk, wherever is it. I I'll make a wish on that rainbow. Now I don't I don't do it in the middle of the street and I make sure it ain't no cars coming. I ain't trying to end my life. <laughs> but I make a I make a wish on that rainbow that's in the road, you know. So. I just, in my vision, intuitively, in my spirit, I, you know, when I get ready to start doing the, the readings this morning, I just, I say, you know what? Rainbow. Spirit is saying rainbow, rainbow. So that is for a lot of you. It's definitely for. So, okay. So it says good things are going to happen. And it says make it happen. Okay. You see that, Aries? Make it happen because good things are about to happen. See that? Oh, my goodness. How did you tell me? Uh, let me tell you something. You can't do nothing with spirit. Holy Spirit, white light, however you put it, because it's definitely a message in everything that the spirit uses me for. 
Okay? So good things are going to happen and make it happen. Make it happen, Aries. Okay? Put your put your put your best foot forward. Aries, put your best foot forward. Make it happen. Cause soon as you start putting your best foot forward, guess what? Guess what, Aries? Yeah, exactly. Good things are going to happen. Mm -mm -mm. So let's see what your energy is. My goodness. My goodness, my beautiful subscribers. Let's see what your energy is. So I have some of these cars that's flipped up and down. And, okay. Let's see. Spirit, Holy Spirit, what is the energy? The energy for Aries. What's the energy for Aries? Yeah, I told you I had some of these cards turned over. Wait a minute. Okay, let me make sure I got them all right, Aries. Let me reshuffle it again. Mm -hmm. I thought I had put them all the right way, but I must have had them all, you know, facing directions. So let's see what your energy is. Spirit, Holy Spirit, what's the energy for Aries? Okay, energy for Aries. Oh! Well, Aries, I don't think that no energy wants to come out for you. My goodness. <sighs> spirit, Holy Spirit, what is the energy? What's the energy for Aries? Let's do this. Ah, meditation. Aries, meditation. See that? That's the energy. A lot of you need to do some meditation. Okay? You really need to do some meditation. Spirit, one more card for Aries. Okay, second card. Okay. All right, so you wanted to hang out with your friends too much. Aries. Is this your, is this you or this is your person's energy coming through saying that you wanted to hang out with your friends too much? We're going to find out. But other than that, just don't get sidetracked, Aries. You make sure you meditate because good things are about to happen in your life. And it's going to take you to um, uh, put your, um, put your, uh, Lord Jesus, put your best foot forward. Thank you, Spirit. It's going to require you to put your best foot forward. Someone energy is coming in. We're going to find out if it's your energy. And I think it's their energy, Aries, saying that you wanted to hang out with your friends too much. Is that true, Aries? Yeah, someone don't want this to end. Aries, someone you was dealing with don't want this to end. Their energy, yeah, you could be... <laughs> Aries, this is you. Are you showing up in your own reading, Aries? You're out of control? Hmm. You don't want something to end? Oh, you having regrets. Now, wait a minute, Aries. Was you dealing with another Aries? Because if you was dealing with another Aries, they don't, he or she don't want this to end. They're out of control and they're, they're having big regrets. Uh, you could be dealing with it, like I said, an Aries, strong Aries here. Um, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces as well. Uh, this person is saying that they that, well they're having big regrets and, and I feel as though Aries you're saying you wanted to hang out with your friends too much. You just wanted to hang out with your friends too entirely too much. Spirit tell me more about Aries reading. Yeah, I feel as though that your person is definitely um at a very low point in their life right now. Your ex person, they're not doing good. They're at a very low point. Uh, very low self-esteem. I take that as a very low point in their life. He or she is overwhelmed, okay? They are overwhelmed. Mm -hmm. 
They're overwhelmed because things are not changing for them. They're overwhelmed because they're not, they're just not doing good. All right. They, they don't want this to end, but you're not falling for it. Okay. They haven't big, they have a big regrets because it shows very powerful here uh, that they don't want this to end, but they're, they're getting overwhelmed because you're not, you're not feeding into it. You're not feeding it to it. Spirit, tell me more about Avery's reading. Tell me more. Yeah. This person cannot move forward. They can't, they can't move forward. I feel like they may be going through a tower moment. Spirit, tell me more about Aries. Thank you. Wow, yeah, you're definitely defensive from this person. You're, you're protecting your heart, but they're not self-sufficient. I believe that your person has, the, the, you know, the Queen of Pentacles is self-sufficient, okay? But it's in reverse. That means the Queen of Pentacles, that, that their finances are something. Um, maybe they lost their job. Oh, my goodness. This person was selfish? Wow. Aries, you're saying that this your your other your ex person is was selfish in the relationship. They're definitely not happy. This person is not happy, but they broke your heart. Look at that. He or she broke your heart. Now they are in isolation. You could have been dealing with a Virgo, Aries. But you're happy now. I feel like a lot of you are very happy. Spirit, tell me more about Aries reading. Tell me more. Okay. Yeah, this is your person just sitting, just thinking, just sitting and thinking about you. Sitting, thinking, having regrets. Look at him. Your ex person is, is sitting, thinking, and having regrets. Mm -hmm. That's them. That's her. That's him. Sitting, thinking. And boy, are they have a re having, having a regrets. And they don't, he or she don't want this to be over. Your ex person feels powerless. Yeah, powerless. They're out of control. They 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 temperance. They're not having patience. They feel your your ex person feel. I thought I heard somebody. Your ex person is definitely, um, yeah. They are. They're definitely losing control. They have lost control. They're just not doing good. Yeah, that's it's like it's almost like they're having withdrawals. They miss your touch, your 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 touch, your energy, your your kisses. They, it's like your person is having withdrawals. Spirit, tell me more about Aries reading. Yeah, they they're definitely having withdrawals because look how they see you. You are full of life. You're shining. You're glowing. A lot of you are happy. Oh, they, th your person is having withdrawals. Yeah, there it is. There it is. You was dealing with a strong Capricorn, Aries, Gemini. Very toxic relationship. I feel like the, your person is, it, it was all about the, it was all about, a, a lot of it was about the sex. Yeah, I might have had a, a powerful sex connection, but it was definitely toxic. It was toxic, and, and he or she is, you know, showing, they're freaking out. They're showing up in the reading, losing control, don't want to move. But you say, I'm sorry, but you wasn't thinking about that when you was hanging out with your friends, your family, your different women, your different men, your different everything. You say, I'm sorry, but I, I, I'm moving on. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You learned the truth. You learned the truth that this person was not truthful to you. You learned the truth and you took a leap of faith and you left this person. Yep. You learned the truth. Yes, you did. Spirit, any other message for Aries? Yeah, it was a lot of fighting, arguing with this person. Yeah, a lot of fighting and arguing. Thank you, Spirit. Any other message for Aries? Taurus, let's get ready to come into my spirit. 
Okay. Yeah, you're focusing you're focused on your job, your money. You're focused on that. You're not you're not studying this person. Mm -mm, not whatsoever. Yeah, they don't want they don't want this connection to end. Look at here. Your ex person is desperately pleading not to end this. In other words, he or she is pleading not to end this relationship or this marriage or whatever because they're definitely talking about you. They're talking to you about somebody. Why? I don't understand. I don't understand. Uh, I, you know, you what? You don't understand what Avery say. What? You don't understand that you was hanging out with your friends too much? You was partying too much, drinking too much? You didn't give a crap how I felt? Yeah. With your toxic self, it was very toxic. Y'all was codependent towards each other on something. Maybe one of you took care of or so each other, or maybe it was, you know, the sex, or maybe it was just plain, you was codependent. on. You had something in common. You had something in common. Yeah, they're worn out. This person is worn out to try to send you a message. They had you in a, okay. Had you in a love triangle. That's what it was. And how you feel good that you don't want this to end? Because the other two triangles, the other two cups left you. Now you want to go back to Aries and see if you can get in good, you know? And see, here go, here go AKA just showed up in your reading, Aries. <laughs> Yeah, AKA just showed up in your reading. Because your person sees you very successful. Aries, something something that y'all some something that y'all are doing, you're successful and AKA has to watch. This is you. You walk a right past. See, start over there. Here you come, AKA sitting on the computer watching you. Fame is success. Oh, he or she don't like it. This is you. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. They don't like it. He or she don't like it. AKA just showed up in your reading. Yeah. Spirit, any other message for Aries? Yeah, this is your twin flame, Gemini. Could have been Gemini. Yeah, you had an enlightenment. The AKA ain't nothing but a player. He was he or she was a player. He or she was a player. Mm -hmm. And that's why you had to manifest. You had to really manifest and pray, and you finally walked away from this Council Scorpio Pisces. You manifested and you prayed, and finally, finally, they got away from this person. Mm -hmm. Yep, their person is isolated. Look here. They're going through a four. They, he or she's stuck. They want y'all to get counseling. A.K.A. wants y'all to get counseling. Uh, they, he or she has a lot of options, but they only focused on you. Yeah. Any other message for Aries? Any other message for Aries? Any other message for Aries? Thank you. Yep, you're blocked off. You're blocked off. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Sorry about that, y'all. Okay. So yeah, you're definitely blocked off. Tell me more. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, AKA wants to come in. Uh, uh, AKA wants to come in and lay his or her. Um, ego down but it's all that they're miserable he or she is very miserable and you're definitely holding yourself back you're holding yourself back from this person because it was a lot of a lot of lies you followed your heart and you left a lot of hidden secrets and lies and deceitfulness 
Yep, you left them out in the cold. You walked away from this person. So it looks like to me, as long as you just stay focused, continue to meditate. Sorry about that pause, y'all. I had to, you know, had to gather my thoughts together. But, um, yeah, continue to meditate. All right, good things are going to happen. And it's going to, you need to put your best foot forward, Aries, so that it can happen. But, yeah, your person, your ex-person is coming into the reading uh, very, very uh, overwhelmed, distraught. Um, now, and now, mind you, he or she had you in the love triangle, but they're coming into the, he or she coming into the reading like, uh, they didn't have you in the love triangle. I mean, I just like, it's, it's, it's crazy, you know, they, they regret what they did to you. They're isolated. This person, your person, ex-person is in deep depression. Your ex-person is in deep depression. Deep depression. Yep, he or she is in deep depression. Okay, let's see what's going on here. Yeah, they in, he or she is in deep depression. Any other message for Aries? Yeah, they're stuck. They're not looking for nobody else. He or she is stuck on you, Aries. Or you are stuck on someone. Yeah, they're vulnerable. They're vulnerable. Yeah, I feel like they're going through a full-blown tower moment. The tower moment is not here, but they're going through it. Yeah, they're losing patience. Oh, wow. Okay. All right, so just continue to work on yourself. Aries, make it happen. Go for it because things are about to change in your life for the better. And I just saw two, two, two. Okay. All right. This has been your reading, Aries. Positive thoughts and energy. Until next time.